Now, is there anything before I pour it? Is there anything special I need to know, like beyond not spilling it? Uh, no, it's it's one of very few bottles here in the state of California for sure. It is available. Mexican moonshine is available in California, but um, it is difficult to find. <laughs> Only very very, um, let's see, fine purveyors will carry that right now. Anyway, this stuff is all double distilled, triple filtered. It's tequila made in the village of Tequila, Mexico. Nice. Um, this is the reposado that we're trying. So it is aged about nine months in bourbon barrels. Wow. And all the fusel oils, aldehydes, and methanols, which are the primary architects of hangover and exist in uh, most, if not all, distilled spirits, have been removed. So it's a very, very clean <gasps> liquor. I'm not saying it won't get <laughs> I was going to say, but yeah. No, it, but it's far, far it. less severe. That's, like, that's some science there. How did yeah. you do that? Our distillers did it. The people at La Fabrica de los Tequilas Finos, which is a really long name for our distillery down there, um, already do that. They do mostly their own private label stuff. They make their own expressions between the two distillers, who are uh, Federico Cabo and Arturo Fuentes. And we um, Cheers, we're lucky enough to to kind of make the cut with them. Salud. And they helped us to create this, our fine Mexican moonshine. Cool. Little tune called Mekong. Cool with that. This this goes to. Um, the fizzy, fuzzy, big and buzzy 20th year anniversary, so. And I'm certain, I'm certain we'll be playing it tonight. So, as cliche as it may sound, I'd like to raise another round. If your bottle's empty, help yourself to mine. Thank you for your time. To this thing we celebrate so much better when we do it together, to life. Sound unlocked, raise another round. 
If your bottle's empty, help yourself to mine Thank you for your time Last cliches in this sound I'd like to raise another round And if your bottle's empty, help yourself to mine Thank you for your time and here's to life Here's to life What used to happen, didn't you guys used to pass around a helmet or a hat or something full of alcohol? It happened one time at a place called Martini Ranch back in probably 2000. We had a giant trophy full of tequila. (laughs) It was before Mexican moonshine. And it has turned into helmets, hats. Yeah, I thought it was something here that I remember from. Oh, maybe it did. And and, uh, it it wouldn't surprise me if I don't remember. And like nothing on you, but when you're starting to pass out a giant vessel full of tequila, (laughs) something's yeah. Then once you pass it out, then you're passing it. Yeah. Oh, a Viking helmet that happened in Mexico too. I remember that. I didn't fill it. Somebody handed it to me. Drink from the chalice of tequila. What are you gonna do? Wasn't my design, but I participated. Yeah. Nice. 